Greetings friends. Michael here. For those of you, who still think that by voting, you are helping to choose the president of the, OUS. Once United States. Check out how this young lady proved it's not so. 12 year old. Brigitte Bavignon was making an effort to trace back her genealogical roots, in France, and decided to branch out to a different kind of family tree. Searching through over 500,000 names, and completing one of the greatest discoveries in genealogical history. This amazing young lady, managed to complete, what even the greatest genealogical groups, had yet to prove that all presidents trace back to one British king, John Lachlan Plantagenet, who was King of England in 1166, and signed the Magna Carta in 1215. He was given the nickname, Lack, Land, because he was the fifth son, and there was originally no land left for him. For those of you, who are familiar with the Illuminati, or the ruling elite families, you probably already knew this and it comes as no surprise, especially if you knew, that pretty much, all our presidents, including George Bush Jr. and Sr., Bill Clinton, Jimmy Carter, and even President Barack Obama, are distant cousins to Elizabeth, the Queen of England. However, Bridgen managed to make, the first family tree of its kind which not only traced back through male family bloodlines of the presidents, but also, and more importantly, she was able, to trace the female sides, of these family trees. Consequently, she managed to link, all presidents back to King John Lachlan Plant Anagat, except for one, Martin Van Buren. In essence, as Bridge Ann explains it, all presidents are cousins, as well as grandsons of King John. Before Bridge Ann's discovery, genealogists were only able to link 22 families of presidents. Bridge Ann said, We all come from somewhere, it's just a matter of proving it. And proving it, she in fact has surely done. Bridge Ann also says she has written President Obama a letter, explaining that she would like to show him her findings as if he doesn't already know. But she says she only got the standard reply. Still think? We as simple citizens? Vote in, our own leaders?